Hi guys, Chet here. Today I'm going to compare Microsoft Planner and Microsoft Project, two of the most widely used project management tools from Microsoft. I'll compare their features, pricing, user experience, integrations, customer support, and more. So by the end of this video, you will have a clear idea of which platform is the right choice for you. First off, let's look at what these tools are built for. Microsoft Planner is a lightweight collaborative task management app included with Microsoft 365. It is perfect for teams that want a simple Kanban style tool to assign tasks, track progress, and visualize your workflow. It integrates directly into Microsoft Teams and Outlook, making it easy to use without needing to learn something new. On the other hand, Microsoft Project is a full-fledged project management solution designed for professionals who need advanced planning tools. It's ideal for managing complex projects with timelines, budgets, dependencies, and multiple stakeholders. Now let's talk about features. Planner gives you a very straightforward board-based layout where you can create tasks, set due dates, assign team members, add attachments, and view progress using charts or schedules. It's excellent for internal team collaboration and short-term projects. Project, however, brings in Gantt charts, critical path planning, roadmaps, resource allocation, and financial tracking. It supports baselines, dependencies, and portfolios, tools that serious project managers rely on for long-term multi-phase initiatives. So if your work involves budgeting, cross-team planning, or timeline forecasting, Project clearly takes the lead. Next up, let's talk about user experience. Microsoft Planner is super easy to use. You know, most people can actually dive right in without any training. That's why it works so well for teams already using Microsoft 365. It's simple and not overwhelming, which helps everyone stick with it. On the other hand, Microsoft Project does take some time to learn. It is a very powerful tool, but you won't figure it all out in just one day. If you're a project manager or someone who knows formal methods like PMI or Agile, you'll really like the control and flexibility that it gives you. Now, when it comes to integrations, both tools work well within Microsoft's ecosystem. Planner integrates with Teams, Outlook, and SharePoint, while Project connects with Power BI, Excel, and other Office tools. You can also use Microsoft's Power Platform to automate workflows across both apps. However, Project's integrations are more focused on enterprise reporting and resource planning, while Planner focuses more on daily collaboration. Let's talk about pricing. Microsoft Planner is included with Microsoft 365 subscriptions starting at $9.99 per user per month. For more advanced features, Microsoft Project offers multiple plans. Project Plan 1 at $10 per user per month, Project Plan 3 at $30 per user per month, and Project Plan 5 at $55 per user per month. Now, all are billed annually. Additionally, there are one-time purchase options like Project Standard 2024 for a one-time fee of $679.99 and Project Professional 2024 for $1,120.99. So, which one should you go with? If you just really need a simple way to assign tasks, organize work, and collaborate within Teams, Microsoft Planner is more than enough. But if you're managing complex projects that require detailed scheduling, cost tracking, and reporting, Microsoft Project is definitely definitely worth the investment. All right, that's it for this video. If you found it helpful, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.